open up the phone and I look at it and sure enough it was a fraud alert. A New Year's Eve celebration turned sour. Michael Bruner says his credit card information was hacked and used in Dubai at the start of the new year. I uh, kind of checked my account and balance real quick. Saw that uh, about $600 had been deducted over in Dubai going to an indoor theme park. After weeks of shopping, traveling, and visiting for the holidays, Bruner says it's time to look over your banking statements. First thing I thought was someone has my card. So I opened up my wallet and I was like, nope, it's right here. So the next thing I thought was who could have possibly taken it. Bruner says his parents and sister's credit card information was also used by crooks. They can't find any common connection other than using their cards in Anderson Township. Some credit card companies provide zero liability protection. Bruner says a fraud alert program through his bank saved him. The Federal Trade Commission says you can protect yourself by refusing to share account numbers over the phone. During transactions, keep your eye on your card and save your receipts to verify final charges. Bruner has his own advice paying cash where you can, um, and make sure you're monitoring your statements. Signing up for fraud alerts, no matter who your bank is, definitely would be something that I would highly recommend. All right, now Bruner says using a debit card in particular can be a bit dicey because it could be compromised. Thieves could wipe out your account balance. He also says that your account access could be in limbo for at least a week until you get your new card. Now, luckily in this case, he says he has been reimbursed all $600. We're live tonight. Dan Griffin, WLWT News 5.